I'm Priscilla Lara, your neighborhood reporter in Arvin. The Arvin Police Department is made up of 23 officers all handling different units. Their latest unit, the K-9 unit, is made up of two officers, Duke and Doggo. This is one of the training methods that Duke and Doggo undergo to help the Arvin Police Department during search procedures. I spoke to Sergeant Brandon Snyder and Officer Edwin Jimenez who demonstrated how Doggo would search for a firearm. Well, right now we're going to demonstrate an article search. Uh, so. Well, uh, we're going to have the op canine officer respond to the scene. <laughs> officer Jimenez uses keywords and check to communicate to the dog as he retrieves the firearm. We get in a lot of pursuits and a lot of uh, vehicle pursuits. And just the fact that we have canine uh, is has stopped a lot of the guys from running from us. Both dogs are originally from European countries and receive specialized training before coming to Arvin. Doggo is from the Czech Republic and is one and a half years old, and Duke is from the Netherlands and is three years old. Duke's partner, Sergeant Brett Barker, says before fighting crime, both dogs were trained as sports dogs. It has different bite scenarios and uh, obedience scenarios and search phases in it. and. When the dog completes the sport, it can receive a title called a PH1, which is a Police Hound 1 dog. Acting Chief of Police Alex Gazalpour sent a statement to ABC where he said, quote, As police chief, I'm very excited at the approval by our city management and council for allowing me to launch a canine program at the Arvin Police Department. Duke and Doggo will soon receive additional training. Duke will receive explosive training and Doggo will receive narcotic training. In Arvin, I'm Priscilla Lara, your neighborhood reporter.